What's up, YouTube? It's Frugal Nista here doing a car diary. I've uploaded a lot of car diaries, but I have not put them out there yet. I'm telling y'all, this is just a way for me to get stuff out of my being into the world, to speak it into existence. Yeah, it's been working for me. And um, I'm probably going to upload the videos, not necessarily worried about who views it. It's just that I put it out in the universe. And if somebody takes some um, something from it, that's a great thing. And then if nobody takes anything from it, it's still a great thing because I've, I've released it. Uh, today is Tuesday. I am out and about grinding, hustling, whatever you want to call it. Um, hubby is home today. And... He put Mirabella on the bus, so I'm out trying to see what I can come up with, you know, on this uh, thing that we call life. Yeah. Yeah. I am rocking the throwback Eagles, the original green. That's right. Um. Uh, yeah, I picked this sweatshirt up for my husband about two decades ago, maybe even more than that. But I still rock it, and every time I wear it, somebody says something about it, they like it. I like the old green, the old Kelly green the Eagles used to wear. Yeah. But I'm about to hit a couple of places. Hope everything is going well. It is truly um, chilly here today. Weather's been kind of iffy. We've been getting warm, chilly, warm, chilly, which has been great because when it is chilly out, I move faster. So I'm out and about, but I'm like really hustling. Like, okay, I'm in and out of the car like real, real fast and I get home quicker when it's cold out here. Um, I'm running into a lot more people. I don't know if it's because of the holidays. Maybe I just didn't pay attention to them before. But I'm running into a lot more people doing this. Um, I know it's not because of my videos. Because I don't have that many views on my videos. And um, again, I think there's still enough stuff out there for all of us that they're throwing away. Uh, I'm concentrating still on um, just trying to get a lot of inventory. And just, you know, rescuing stuff from landfills. That sounds real you know, heroic of me, but the honest opinion is I'm trying to create some income from my pocket. Um, this has been doing very well for me. I'm appreciative of what I've picked up so far, and I just know there's a lot more to be picked up. Yeah. So, guys, um, told y'all how I do it told y'all when I do it and I've told y'all why I do it I've just really got to get my uh, resources together to work smarter and not harder this is so easy seriously y'all it's like taking candy from a baby but I know I could be doing it still in a smarter way with the access of the world through the internet through um you know, websites like eBay, Amazon, uh, Craigslist, without having to do so much physical labor as far as getting my stuff to market, like when I do my flea market. Is it another store opening? Oh, it's a Sears outlet opening. Wow. Hmm. Never knew that. Sears outlet is going there. Okay. Is it open yet? Yeah, so I am out and about in retail world, about to hit the back door to some of my favorite places. My first stop is Staples, Burlington Co. Factory. I ran into a husband and wife at that little spot yesterday. And um, I'm gonna roll up on this really, really quick. And I could tell that somebody had been in my stuff um, let's see what they have in here. It's cold out today. 
Yeah, somebody's been here already. They've been in it. Yeah, so this is what I do, guys. I just kind of peek. I don't even have gloves on. Somebody's already been here. But I got a box to get rid of also. This is what I get scared of because I don't want to get a ticket for uh, dumping. Because <laughs> this is against the law, putting your trash in these reciprocals. But, hi. <laughs> that because that would be my just my luck right so camera's still rolling y'all see how I do it it's nothing in there I just take a peek on the top I've shown y'all that before it's cold out today I'm going to take a peek in the one behind Burlington Co factory and somebody asked me last night you know this is a I love these kind I'm rolling up on a a square one. This looks like you're going into the refrigerator. Okay, I am going to put my glove on. Because look at it. That's how it looks. And um, I'm just going to take a peek in there. As soon as I figure out how to put my glove on with one hand. I'm just going to put one hand on because I don't think there's probably anything in here. But I'll see. And it's like opening a refrigerator. Watch this. Oh, goody stuff. Okay, guys. It's stuff in here. Bye. Frugal needs to about to get busy. Okay, guys. Woo! Exhilarating. It's like shopping. You should see how much stuff I have. Look. Look, 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 look. Yes. In your hand. Ah, that was exhilarating, refreshing. Your intelligence, you move me. Yes, on my feet. Think about you. Oh, okay, what am I doing next? I'm excited. Here we go. Call us. got to be the prettiest song ever written or sung. I didn't realize I wasn't a huge Jill Scott fan in the very beginning until I heard that song by her. And from a vocal standpoint, being a formal vocal student, girl can sing. She got pipes. She got control of her instrument. All right, I'm gonna check this place, which I never find anything at Ross. Bunch of boxes though. All right, hold on a minute. I'll leave it running. Yeah, just a bunch of boxes. Da 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 da. Breathe. It's a pretty song. Empty bet. I am so pumped. Thank you, Burlington Co Factory, and thank you that I got there quicker than the other couple I saw doing it. 
little old couple, old man and his wife, or girlfriend, or sister, whoever she was. <sighs> I'm exhilarated. I got some really nice stuff, guys. Check this out real quick. Uh, you got me feeling like the breeze. Look at this beautiful coat. Look at that. Gorgeous in a size 5-6 for a little girl in pink. Cute. What else is here? Check this out, guys. These sell really good for me when they don't uh, cut the cord. This is just a clearance. It looks like it might be a return because it was open and they didn't cut the cord so bet I'm going to be able to sell that even for five bucks and look at this guys here's a ring and check this out this is really cute I wonder what I got rid of this look at this leather jacket child A large pretty leather jacket in white see if the zipper is broken no the zipper works that is cute and check out these Madden girl cute little red. but anyway it's about putting stuff out in the universe positive that's how I feel me getting on here and speaking it into existence I was kind of I don't want to say reluctant but when I see like I was worried about I see so many people out here doing it now and what I'm saying that to say is and what I'm realizing even as I'm speaking this that they have nothing to do with the blessing that God has for me it has nothing to do with it so if they were there then, that was specifically for them to get. And whatever's out here for me, Vivica, the frugal nista, I will get. I just, that's, a, that's powerful. And if somebody can get that lesson like me, I'm getting that lesson now. If you can get that, what's out there for you, it's out there for you. And nobody can take it from you. Nobody can take it from you. So these treasures that I just found that... The universe God has given me, I'm going to take it and be grateful for it because realizing you see in somebody else like, wow, they're over there getting it. I'm worried about this little landscaper guy do it. That's for him. If he gets it, fine. That's what God has for him. That's what he, that's his blessing. And whatever blessing that I have, nobody can take it from me. That's just beautiful, man. That's just beautiful. Wow. Love it. So this is a learning tool for me, guys. Y'all don't realize how much YouTube has helped me out with that. Like, really? I'm just a proponent now. Putting it out there in existence and just being positive and trying to put out positive man and catch me some positive bad, really. And, um, again, you don't know how many people in YouTube land, whether they know it or not, have helped me. Listening and looking at what they put out. So, yeah. I'm happy. I'm, I'm so happy right now. I'm leaning, but I'm happy. Back leaning again. Yeah. So I'm going to head to Bed Bath & Beyond where the landscaper and I have this little battle royale going. But it's funny, this 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 Bath Bath & Beyond used to be a, a, a big uh, place for me when I first started doing this this summer. But it's funny how things work. I don't get a lot from this Bed Bath & Beyond anymore, but they just opened a new Pier 1 close to this Bed Bath & Beyond, and I found already, the store hasn't even been open, I don't think, a week. Maybe two weeks. Maybe this is the second week, going into their second week. But I found so much un, um, undestroyed, like they did not destroyed items there. It's not even funny. So... He closes one door and another one opens. That's just, I can't, it's, it's blowing me right now. It's blowing my mind. Yeah. So 